Lions basketball coach, David Richmond, student athlete, Bowden Skunberg. As always, we'll do an opening statement from coach. We'll take questions for the student athlete. Once we get done with questions with the student athlete, we'll dismiss him. Get back to questions for coach. Please identify name and organization ahead of your questions. Go ahead with your opening statement, coach. Yeah, a um, little bit like deja vu. Um, it's 365 days ago to uh, you know, another historic team. The team is 21 and 0, just like South Dakota State was last year. And Paul's clearly done a really good job at that program, particularly well, two of the last three years. It's a very talented outfit. Uh, and for us, there's a standard to, to get on this stage, and we haven't been able to push over the last couple of years. That's something that you know, we have a challenge just going forward to, to continue to be better. Part of that was just taking this group onto the stage, getting this experience, getting our feet wet, um, and getting to work. I'm also going to take the opportunity, well, uh, I have one of my favorite human beings in the world next to me to, I don't know, maybe a little bit out of context, but I think it's a, it's a cry and shame that, you know, this young man, you know, at, at times gets judged for 40 minutes out of the day. And, and that's probably why he's just honorable mention when he should be a lot higher than that, in my opinion. And I just challenge a lot of people to get to sit, sit in the chair that I do and, and experience everything very very misunderstood individual besides my family there's there's no greater challenge to me there's no greater reward to me than Bowden scumber and uh some guys with big chips on our shoulders from north dakota got a lot of pride in this place I promise you this two of us are going to continue to work go ahead with questions uh jeff go back on Bowden. Uh, how would you describe that first half? I mean, they, I feel like they just punched us in the face. I mean, we didn't want ready for it. We were, I went and out of the gates, I think, I think, and we just did that job of carrying over and scouting. I mean, they just started about five, and they're, they're, uh, they're not shooting a couple of these shots. And they just, it was a struggle right there in the first half, for sure. Was it was it tight? I might be feeling the form. Was it was it you guys were tight? You think, or was it just what what Will Roberts came out of the gate just popping? Was it? I think it was a little bit of both. I mean, not that young guys were scared, but you know they had never been in this you know, environment, the setting before, and like, they were hitting a lot of tough shots. Like I said, the like, shooters were making shots, and everyone's just making shots. So it's a little combination of both. When a kid like Obama's hitting shots like he was, I mean, that's just adds one more layer to the yeah. difficulty, right? Yeah, I mean, that's, I mean, he's a good player, don't get me wrong, but that's kind of how the night was. Um, well, our scout was kind of, you know, let him not let him shoot, but, you know, but he's a good player. And, you know, kudos to him for his shots. Well, Don, so WDAY is three years in a row to be this close. Describe the frustrating part of being that close and not being able to get over the hump. Yeah, you know, I think. You know, Dave kind of said the best, you know, we're, we're competitors. That's, that's all we want to do is win. And it hurts a lot. I can't even lie, it sucks. But you know, nothing you can do now besides get back to work. And I, th I think, you know, Dave's done an incredible job this, this whole year. You know, even at the beginning of the year when we said oh, our record was terrible, he said, you know, trust the process. You know, you know, not everyone understood that, but you see it now, you know, Dave, he knows what he's doing. And we, we, I think we trusted that process and we got us here. And I think, you know, next season starts now for us. I'll start with five for both day and age with the portal and all the things, independent of decision. But how much do you kind of take on? It's like this group would be really special. Do you take on kind of a role of keeping the, the, these guys together as best as you can? I, I mean, we're a family right now. I, I don't see any of us sticking on that portal. I mean, you know me, I'm not going anywhere. I fell in love with the process. I fell in love with Dave as a coach. You know, I think, you know, it'll be exciting year, next year for us, for sure. All right, thanks, Bowden. You can head back to the locker room. Thank you, Coach. Hey, what was it about 
Oral Roberts start that just was too hard to overcome? No, it, it's go back to the year 20, our group like that. You got a mature group, got a group, I think sometimes, I don't know, Paul, I don't want to put words in Paul's mouth, but he'd tell you like the greatest challenge is just sometimes getting them to the finish line. And when you get them to the finish line, it's just about turning them loose. Just a really hungry group, really mature group. Um, you know, they made shots. They also beat us to some loose balls, got us on the glass. But again, I, I'm I'm not going to backpedal on anything I said the last two nights sitting right here in the same chair. I'm, I'm very proud of the growth that this group has made, but um, we ran into a really mature, hungry group tonight. Kind of Van, kind of Van Hoven was just a presence that Andrew's having some problems with. Grant, uh, everyone's having problems with the ball. Let's talk to him. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's it's very unique. It's um, something that you can't simulate in practice. Um, you know, you give the young man credit. He's he's long. He's maybe not as, as physical as some, but he understands, you know, how to use his strengths and, and even the shots that he's not blocking, he, he's altering, he's making you think about them. And uh, to, to me, like, listen, Max is um, as good as there's been in this league, clearly, uh, but, but they're able to crank things up on the other end of the floor on the perimeter because they know they got protection at the rim. And, and that's, that's where their defensive numbers have really improved this year. Yeah, what do they do to keep Grant down to the count? 32 games. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I don't know. I mean, that's something, too, that I'll, I'll go back and, and take a look at in, in different spots that, you know, we, we were able to have success with him, um, with Grant at their place. But, but again, you know, I, I thought, you know, Wamba uh, was really engaged on both ends of the floor. Thompson was physical with them. They, they, they just were the more assertive, aggressive team this evening. Well, the last question right here. Coach, you've been kind of a... It's the way tournament or bus program. This is such a young group. If there were an opportunity in postseason, is that something you might look at a little differently? You know, we'll we'll discuss everything with an administration. Um, you know, um, I, I, I am very clear. Like I'm, I, I love these guys. Um, I thank them. I coach them very hard. You know, for four months out of the year, and they just keep showing up. They're resilient because of guys like this at the top. Um, and um, I, I do really feel like bright things are ahead.